Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch. In this video, I want to go ahead and update our USB stick uh, to the latest image file for the PS4 9.00 jailbreak. Um, if we jump over to ChatterChap, I believe I'm pronouncing that correct. Uh, if you jump over to his GitHub, you can see the old image file here, uh, 9.00 kernel exploit, and it was released last month. Uh, but he did go ahead and create a new image file and this one was released two days ago. So we'll go ahead and select it. And then if you go ahead and hit the download button, it will automatically download. Now I do have my download set up to go on the desktop. If we go ahead and minimize it, you can see that I do have it here. Um, now we're going to need an, something to write it to the USB. So we'll go ahead and open up our browser and we'll go to the Win32 disk image site and we'll go ahead and hit download. And that'll download too as well. Uh, it's very small. It doesn't take long at all to download once it does get going. As you can see, a couple of seconds once it does get going. Um, so we'll go ahead and minimize that for now. We can go ahead and bring up our disk image. And we'll go ahead and double click on that. Now if you do get asked for a security warning, just say yes to run it. Um, we'll go ahead with I accept, next. And we, can, we'll, we will create a desktop shortcut. Go ahead and install it. Doesn't take long at all to install, as it is a pretty small file. So we'll go ahead and uncheck all that as well. Hit finish. We can go ahead and move this up here. And also, you can go ahead and check out Cheddar Chap's GitHub. It does explain uh, basically everything to get it running. It. Uh, it does have the old image there, but uh, yeah, it's pretty straightforward. So we'll go ahead and minimize that, and we'll open up our disk image program. And if you get asked for a security warning, just say yes to it as well. Um, from there, we'll go ahead and select our image. Mine's on the desktop. Yours might have downloaded to a different location, but just go ahead and browse for it, and then go ahead and select it. Now over to the right, we do have our devices. I only have the one USB plugged in. You might have multiple uh, devices plugged in. Uh, just make sure you do select the right one. I wouldn't want you to erase anything that's valuable. Um, yeah, but just once you do have it selected, you can go ahead and hit the right button. And then once you get asked, are you sure you want to continue, just say yes to it and write successful. Go ahead and hit OK. And that's basically it, guys. Um, it is a pretty short video. I just want to jump on, show you how to uh, create that image with the updated file. But yeah, I'm going to leave the video at that. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It really helps out the channel. Hey guys, I just want to point out something. Um, I do appreciate everybody that likes and subscribes. Um, but I never mentioned Twitter or anything. And Twitter is a, a big thing that helps out the videos a lot. Um, this morning when I got up, I was over a 1,000 followers. I do appreciate all the followers I do have. Um, and if you do go ahead and hit that follow button, I do appreciate you as well. Um, but yeah, I do appreciate the, the people that do retweet everything. Retweeting does help out the channel a lot. Uh, people that like it as well. Um, but yeah, I just want to jump on and thank everybody that's been following me. I hope to see you in the future. And uh, yeah, I hope I keep the content straight and it's good for you. But yeah, I'll leave the video at that. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one.